There were one group of people, however, who hesitated from giving Abu Bakr the bayah, and that was Ali. Ali was busy handling the arrangements for the Prophet's burial. So he was not present at that meeting and had no opportunity to give his opinion or give his input. And as the senior male member of the Prophet's family, he most certainly deserved that opportunity. He most certainly had the status and the honor to give his opinion and be present in that discussion. But things happened without him being there. And he did not immediately give Abu Bakr the bayah, though he would give him bayah several years later, several months later really, you give Abu Bakr Baya, but for the first six months of Abu Bakr's rule or administration as a Khalifa, Ali would not give him the Baya. And that's because Ali felt slighted at not being present or not having been consulted with Abu Bakr becoming leader. It's not that he disputed Abu Bakr's leadership, he disputed the fact that he was chosen without Ali being a part of it. Abu Bakr, in his defense, he wasn't coming for that. He heard that people were about to choose a leader and he went over there to make sure things were done right. Things were happening very fast once again and he didn't have a cell phone to text Ali. Say, Ali, you're about to choose, we're about to choose a leader. Come on over here quickly if you can. That couldn't be done. Ali missed out on it, not because Abu Bakr and Omar were trying to deceive him or trying to trick him or anything like that, just the way things turned out. Sometimes we have to accept that people are human and humans make mistakes, or if not mistakes, sometimes things happen that are just outside of our control. This was something that happened outside of Abu Bakr's control. He had started off trying to keep Medina from exploding in grief and sorrow and holding the Muslim community as, together as best as he can. Then he wanted to make sure that the community didn't separate under different leaderships and different factions and tribes. And next thing you know, he's, he's chosen as the Khalifa of the Muslim Empire. And he didn't really plan for any of this to happen.